Hey guys, welcome back. So today I'm going to be doing my October favorites. Um, I know it's been a long time since I've done a favorites video. I have actually finally found the charger to my camera while cleaning up the stuff in my bins. So I'm very thankful for that. But um, let's get right into it. Um, it's really just a bunch of makeup. Um, there are a few clothing. There are like two clothing pieces and yeah so let's get started with the video and yes I am wearing my old glasses I um, just didn't feel like putting on the new ones today okay so first is face products and the first product is um, my makeup forever HD high definition foundation this one is in I do not know. I think this is 185. This is the darkest one. Um, yeah. So I've been wanting this foundation for a very long time. And I am very glad that I actually got this foundation. This is an amazing foundation. It is slightly darker than my skin tone. But when I put this on and I do the rest of my makeup, it matches me really, 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 really well. And why did I get this one? Because the one before this color, it actually was the perfect skin tone for me, but um, it it oxidizes red on me, so this is perfect for me. Um, I do have a picture of me wearing this, and I will show that. Uh, I will show that. Well, I can't really show it. I think I just actually deleted the picture, but you can just check out my Instagram with me wearing this foundation. I might be able to actually put the picture in here, but we shall see. Um, but yeah, I absolutely do love this foundation. I am not wearing any makeup right now because I still want to put on makeup today. Um, but yeah, this foundation is like love right now. I absolutely love it. It lasts for a very long time and it has a pump, which I absolutely adore. About this foundation now this foundation is quite pricey but absolutely completely worth it I really do think this is a, this is worthy of being like a really awesome foundation so I absolutely love this foundation and I'm very glad I got this foundation next is my NARS um, pure radiant scented moisturizer foundation this is in a Polynesia Ugh. yeah I love this love this scented moisturizer I was using it all summer and uh, I did use it when I went to work a couple of days ago um I love this foundation this is great I uh, it still shows off your skin the but this foundation is awesome I don't this is like this type of this is the moist the tinted moisturizer when I don't want to put on like tons of makeup on my face and I don't I still want my skin to show through and I love this foundation. Um the person who put me on to this foundation was Nephi Fofro and I will put her link down in the down bar below. She is a natural YouTuber, um natural hair YouTuber and I just love her for this. She's awesome, so yeah. Next is my of course my Moisture Surge found, um, tinted, no, my Moisture Surge Extended Thirst Relief Cream. This is a gel cream. This is from Kalink. I've had this for really, really, I've actually had this for about a year now. Yeah, I've had this for a year now. Still full, as you can see. I only actually use this when I put on foundation, so I use this for, like, before I put foundation on, and this works amazingly well my skin feels so amazing with this and it's algae tested and 100% fragrance free so I love this this is again an expensive product but this is so worth it um I was actually put on this product because it was a deluxe sample from um Sephora and I thank you Sephora because this is now my go-to cream ever I absolutely love this thank you next is of course my Urban Decay D Slick Oil Control Found um, Spray. I use this um, to set my makeup, and honestly, this does control the oil um, for like most 
of the time. Um, I would probably have to redo this probably every five or six hours. And but yeah, it still lasts a really long time. So, and I actually have have had this for like maybe two years now. It's still not done, but I, I rarely put on makeup anymore. So that's quite understandable. I am putting on makeup again. So this will probably be done. Now we'll, we'll likely have to replace this. Yeah. Next is my blush. My next blush, this is in Desert Rose. This is the first blush I have had from have had from them. It smells like makeup. And I love this color. This color is perfect for my skin tone. You can definitely you don't have to use too much. Um but it works. Um I will I actually think I still have the picture of me putting having this on and I'll definitely put that in right now. But and I, yeah, I do have a picture of me with this on and I absolutely love this color. This color is amazing and it's just a nice rosy, rosy gold, rosy color with like tints of shimmer in it and I just, I love this. It is amazing. Next, um, for the eyes, I have been loving, this is a MAC. This is a MAC paint pot and groundwork, and I have been loving this. And it doesn't really smell like anything, but this is like perfect for um, putting over, I mean, under, under like um, eyeshadow. Yeah, brain fart. Yeah, but this is perfect for going under eyeshadow. I really do love this um, paint pot. This is actually perfect for me and if you're like my skin tone or maybe like a little bit lighter this would definitely work for you next is actually my naked three palette um, I bought this in January and I've had this for a while now I haven't even taken the brush out of it yet but I've actually used a few of the colors in here and I love the colors um definitely I love strange I most of the time I'm Eve I'm using Lunar and Dark Side and Black Heart and I absolutely love the colors they're like freaking amazing I have used Burnout I'm actually trying to do like more colors so yeah I love the Naked 3 palette it is great I have seen that Urban K has come up with their Naked um like the whole naked line I'm not gonna buy that though because I have like a ton of their naked products and I don't I, I mean I guess I could give it away but I can give away the palettes because I would really like it but $208 that's quite a lot so we shall see next is my cover girl I mean I think this is cover girl yes this is my cover girl um bombshell volume by lash flash um comes with two mascara formulas I mean I don't think it's really it seems like the same but it's in very black I got this one this was on markdown at my um, local grocery store and oh my gosh this is amazing um, it definitely elongates my lashes um, the first one uh, separates and like lengthens and the second one just goes way way above there and I love this product uh, it is worth it I will tell you because this is absolutely a really great great mascara and I love it I'm constantly using it I'm actually wearing it in the photo that I showed you before and yeah this product is great great so let me tell you just freaking amazing Okay, since we're all still doing face products, I'm going to show you the product that I've been loving for putting on my foundation and stuff like that. And that is my Beauty Blender. And if you don't know what this is, where hell, where have you been? Like, everyone talks about this. And yeah, you can get this at Sephora. Or you can get this at a Sephora counter. This is like 20 bucks. So worth it. I've had this one for since... Uh, February and it's still going strong I did went ahead and bought another one because I just love it so much and I even bought one for my sister 
and I actually went ahead and bought the um, the Beauty Cleanser Solid. This works amazingly well with the Beauty Blender, of course, because it's by Beauty Blender. Um, but yeah, it works amazingly well. And my sister actually went ahead and got me the Real Techniques Miracle Complexion Sponge, which I haven't had a chance to use yet. But it looks like this. And it just has a flat top, rounded bottom, and a really full. And for some reason, because it's been in the container for a while, it has that thing stuck to it. Yeah. But yeah, I went ahead and got that. And now I'm going to show you my favorite eyebrow products which is to my tweezer man tweezers um I got this from Marshalls or TJ Maxx I don't know which one but looks like they yet and this is their um breast cancer awareness one I absolutely love this this is great um yeah I just absolutely love this product so yeah just a normal blender thingy. I mean tweezer. Okay next up is lip products and if you've seen that picture I showed you before you would have seen I am wearing red. I have been loving reds now. I have bought literally three red lipsticks from MAC because I just really like red. Um, but the first one is not a MAC color. This is actually the next butter gloss and this is in red velvet i love this color it is so freaking red you have no freaking idea looks like that sorry i have like tons of products in my hand at this point yeah but it's like red and like really red and it looks like that I love the color it just looks so freaking pretty and yeah it's just a really nice glossy red I would think of this more of like a um more like a vampire ready red type color um but it looks really really good let me tell you next up is my MAC lipstick and this is from Viva Glam Rihanna and of course it is another nice color red this is a frost color I've never actually had a frost from Mac I always do the mattes but that's Rihanna's color and it is very very pretty with this one I don't actually have to put on like lip gloss or anything like that I don't usually like lip gloss that's why I always buy their mattes because I like their mattes um, I just love matte colors in general, but the frost one is definitely leaning me towards frost colors because that color is just perfect. Next, of course, I went ahead and got the MAC Ruby Room. And I can see why there's a lot of hype to this color because this color is definitely like the, a true red color. And it just it's just so freaking nice, so pretty. And it is matte, which I love matte, and it looks like that, and I just love the color. It's just so nice, so freaking pretty. <sighs> I love, the love this color. And I just got this. This is Diva, and this is also a matte color. And this, will, this one I was actually wearing in that picture, and it looks like that. I absolutely adore this color. This I've always gotten. I actually I get compliments on wearing Ruby Roo and wearing um, Diva. I haven't actually worn the. Actually, yeah, I have actually worn this. But yeah, like reds are just my favorite favorite color. So I just love all the colors that I have. Okay, so next up is just 
body body stuff and my favorite is of course my body clear body wash by Neutrogena. I absolutely love this product. Um, I use this product because I do have like it is a form of acne I have on my body and I don't it's not acne though but um yeah I use this and I haven't seen it since since using this I have not seen it I do wish that um Neutrogena will come up with a um, sensitive skin one because um people out there don't like the people who don't like this product have sensitive skin and honestly this is an amazing product I personally don't have sensitive skin so I can pretty much use this and not have any problems in the world I always use this product my body loves this product and this is literally the only body wash I have and I absolutely love this product because it doesn't have a freaking scent it has a nice clean scent which washes completely off when you are done taking a shower and this is love because I love this product this is the only body wash I will ever buy I have tons of these and I just, I love these products. This is an amazing, amazing buy and I love it. Okay. Next, we have this EOS Shave Cream. This gives you 24 hours of deep moisture and for with natural shea butter and aloe. Nourishes and softens skin. And this is in Vanilla Bliss. Y'all know I love me some vanilla. And anything that smells like vanilla, I'm going to buy. Um... This is amazing. My sister put me on to the shade, the the cream. I mean, not the cream, but the yeah, the shave cream. And I've not looked back since. This lasts for 36 months. You can actually recycle this product. It's awesome. You can use it wet or dry. I actually use it wet or dry, and this is this is the best shave cream. Ever. Your skin will feel so freaking smooth. Trust me, when you go to this, you will not go back. I'm telling you, you will not go back. Use it. Okay, next is for clothes. I'm actually wearing a shirt right now. It looks like this. It is, of course, Zelda and Link. Uh, I don't know if you can see. Yeah, put Zelda and Link. I got this from. Hot Topic, that's where I get most of my shirts from, or I get them online. And if I do, I will, of course, put it down in the down bar below. I like this shirt. Shirt's awesome. Um, my session with Link and just Legend of Zelda and Doctor Who in general, they fulfill that obsession. I love them. Next up is shoes. I got these shoes from Shoeland. They look like this. They have nice silver detailing on it. And y'all know I love me my boots. And yeah, they look like that. They just look freaking adorbs. I love them. I'm always constantly wearing these now. These will be worn to the fullest extent. And yeah, they just look like these. These are like really, really nice. And I just love them. Okay, so I have been talking for 18 minutes now. That's a really long freaking time. Hopefully you guys enjoy this video. And I'm sorry that I haven't been making videos. Even though I have, I've just put up two new videos in the last two to three weeks. Hopefully y'all all enjoyed the, that. Um, please comment, like, subscribe. Definitely tell me what y'all think about the video. And yeah. Please come back soon. I am making more videos because I finally found the charger to my camera. And I finally have good lighting. Well, as good as it's going to get anyway. Hopefully. And I will see you guys in more videos.